New Honda WRV is being studied for an India launch, will go on sale in Indonesia first. Honda has taken the wraps off the second-gen WRV in Indonesia, where it will go on sale first. The much-awaited new gen WRV gets a unique design, as opposed to its predecessor, and is more of an SUV than a cross hatchback. New Honda WRV is longer, wider and taller than its predecessor. Gets a 1.5-liter petrol engine good for 121 horsepower. Also comes with six airbags, Honda's at Aspect. New Honda WRV, styling cues. The new WRV is actually a production version of the Honda Concept RS SUV and as such a strong styling resemblance between the two is evident. The new gen WRV shares styling cues with bigger Honda SUVs like the HRV and the SUV that are sold overseas. The overall design of the new WRV is more coupe SUV-like, with a tapering roofline and an angular tailgate design. The glass house is large with a steeply raked front and rear glass. For an SUV, it also gets a prominent shoulder line and chunky body cladding on the lower part of the doors with the wheel arches housing large alloy wheels, 16-inch or 17-inch, depending on variant. The SUV gets stylish angular wraparound headlamps, with the grille neatly blending with the front bumper that features a simple design with a wide AM. The new WRV SUV gets a prominent C-pillar that complements its straight rear tailgate design. It features slim, horizontally positioned LED tail lamps and has a chunky bumper that houses a license plate enclosure and a four-skid plate. The Honda WRV gets two styling packages, the WRV-E with simpler cues and 16-inch alloy wheels, and a sportier WRV-RS version with 17-inch alloys, red accents, new grille and all-black interiors, among other unique bits. It will also have dual-tone exterior paint schemes. The WRV Sports analog dials with a 4.2-inch mid, and also gets an option to start engine and air conditioning remotely using a key in higher variants. New Honda WRV, Dimensions the WRV sits on the same platform that underpinned the previous gen city and the latest domain sold in India. The new WRV is 4,060mm long, 1,608mm high and 1,780mm wide, which makes it longer, wider and taller than the previous gen WRV. It also has more ground clearance at 220mm. The new WRV has a boot space of 380 litres. Honda has loaded the new WRV SUV with more safety kit too. It now comes with six airbags, and also the carmakers at Aspect, Honda Sensing, which comes with lane keeping assist, automatic emergency braking, lane departure warning, adaptive cruise control and auto high beam assist. New Honda WRV, Interior. Interior of the new WRV looks almost identical to the Honda Amaze. If you find the Honda WRV's interior looks familiar then you are not wrong. Honda has replicated almost all interior bits in the WRV from the Amaze sedan that we get in India. The dashboard, infotainment screen steering wheel, controls and even the seats seem to be same as the Amaze. New Honda WRV, powertrain details. Power comes from a 1.5-liter petrol engine good for 121 horsepower and 145 newton meters of torque. Gearbox duties are carried over by a 5-speed manual or a CVT gearbox. This is the same engine that sees duty on the Honda City sedan in India. New Honda WRV, will it come to India? As we've reported earlier, Honda is working on an all-new SUV for the Indian market, which will rival the likes of the Hyundai Creta, Kia Seltis, Maruti Suzuki Grand Vitara and the Toyota High Rider. This new SUV will be around 4.2 meter long and will sit on the 5th Gen City platform as opposed to the older 4th Gen City architecture on which the new WRV shown today is based on. As far as an India entry for the new WRV is concerned, this new SUV, according to sources, is under study for the Indian market and may come to India post the launch of Honda's Creta rival, which is slated to hit Indian showrooms just ahead of festive season of 2023. Also see, discounts of up to 63,000 rupees on Honda WRV, City, Jazz, Omaze in November.